in every aisle every day at Coles. Save on footy final favourites. New to downtown, Coles Bakery Jumbo Roll Six Pack with no artificial preservatives, just $3. I always save money at Coles. Coles Barbecue One Kilo Pack, now downtown to just $7.50. That's the winner. Red Rock Deli Potato Chips, 165 grams, just $2.25. That's half price. If you love to save, I save $21.68. Good things are happening to prices at Coles. missed a late penalty that would have tied the score. 
but the situation was made worse as Wormsley was concussed chasing the kick, then ruled out for the second half. But the Lions started well after the break, a penalty made it 10 all. There was controversy when Nick Glow crashed over, he appeared to be held up, but Lakes were awarded the try and now led 16-10. But Souths weren't behind for long. Joey Morris scrambled over from dummy half. The Lions led 18-16 thanks to another penalty before Lakes returned serve to make it 18-all. But when Luke Higgins barged his way over, Souths had one hand on the trophy. The Lions' defence was working overtime, snuffing out wave after wave of seagull attacks. A try to Cameron King in the final seconds sends Souths into party mode as the Lions claim their second title in three seasons. Yeah, we've had to play the top two teams the last five weeks of the competition. And we had to do that as well in 2016, so we're refreshing that we're well-deserved from you. Earlier in the day, Wests claimed the ladies' league tag decider, outclassing Souths 14 points to 8. The Lions scored first through Logan Flanagan, who took an intercept, then raced 90 metres. The Rosellas hit back as Nicole Stanfield teed up Riani Kipta. Both sides then slotted penalties as the score ended up at 8 all at full time. West would have the last laugh, hanging on in extra time to claim the title. The W League Jets have announced three more signings with defensive trio Claire Coelho, Sophie Nananovic and Claire Wheeler committing to the 2018-19 season. Coelho will be looking to establish herself as Newcastle's number one after spending last season as backup to American Britt Eckerstrom. Much luck this year, and that trend continued for Charlotte Pointing during round six of the Aussie Racing Car Series at Sydney Motorsport Park. Brake problems interrupted her charge on Saturday. Today it was a rival driver. He's in my Manoa, Charlotte Pointing. She still has plenty to look forward to with a potential super huge drive at Bathurst and Newcastle. Jane, that's our look at sport. Thank you, Mitch. We've got a couple of cool days on the way. We'll check all the weather details next.
So call into Murray's Beach and let me personally introduce you to this beautiful project. It's buy one get one half price on absolutely everything store-wide, including lounges, bedrooms, living and dining, sale items and more. Plus, get it all on 60 months interest-free. Hurry, ends tomorrow, only at Amart Furniture. As many as two in every seven vehicles in Australia have been installed with faulty Takata airbags. These airbags have the potential to seriously injure or kill their drivers and passengers. Is your vehicle one of them? Enter your number plate at ismyairbagsafe.com.au or text to Carter to 0487 airbag. Replacement is free. Tonight's weather is proudly brought to you by the Burton family, Mayland and Port Stevens Toyota. Call in to get your best price on a new Toyota. To the weather now, a cool and showery start to the week with temperatures taking a tumble for the next couple of days. Vivid colours in this striking sunset shot from Mitchell Gresham. It's a long exposure taken at Waters Bay Esplanade on a cloudy afternoon just after sunset. Up to the satellite patchy cloud along the New South Wales and Queensland coasts in onshore winds is causing the odd light shower. Skies are clearer to the west under the influence of a high pressure system. Tomorrow, a low pressure trough in the east will produce showers and thunderstorms, mainly about southern Queensland as well as parts of northeast New South Wales. Onshore winds will bring showers along the eastern seaboard tomorrow. Mostly sunny today with some strong winds at times. There's a medium chance of showers about the lower Hunter tonight, a slight chance elsewhere. A top of 19 for Newcastle today, 23. Sorry for Newcastle, 19 at Nobbies, 14 to 20 at Nelson Bay, reaching 26 at Singleton, 27 at Scone. Tomorrow, cloudy and cool with a medium chance of showers, most likely during the day. Blustery, southerly winds on the way as well. Just 17, the top for Newcastle and Nelson. Bay, the same at Raymond Terrace, 18 for Maitland and Wall's End, 18 also the top for Singleton and Merry War. Information seas and swell at two metres, southerly winds turning southeasterly and up to 30 knots, so some strong winds on the way tomorrow. Sunrise at 20 to 6 and sunset at 10 to 6. And the outlook for Newcastle, Tuesday partly cloudy with a slight chance of a shower, a top of just 17 tomorrow, 18 on Tuesday. For Scone this week, some possible drizzle tomorrow, temperatures rising later in the week, up to 30 degrees possible on Friday. And for Gosford, also cooler for the next couple of days and getting warmer for Thursday and Friday. Follow us on Facebook for more local sports stories and news. And that's our bulletin for this evening. The Today Show will have the latest news tomorrow morning. For now, though, from all of us here. Good night. Good night.